Did you know that President Vladimir Putin is one of the wealthiest men in the world? That's right. In fact, he might be the wealthiest man in the whole world. But how does he spend his billions? What kind of private jets and yachts does he use to travel the world? How many homes does he have? Let's get it on. Car collection. Can you picture having a garage with a room for 700 cars? That's insane. There are rumors that the Russian president owns more than 700 vehicles. As far as the vehicles we are aware of, it is evident that Putin enjoys traveling in a limousine. He once had the Mercedes-Benz S600 guard Pullman, but it was replaced by an Aura Senat limousine as the official state vehicle for the Russian president. The car is outfitted with numerous life-saving, offensive and defensive features and was designed under Federal Protection Service specifications. This luxurious limo would have cost more than $300,000. The Aura Senat was created in Russia by NAMI as a part of the Cortez project, and it was officially unveiled for the first time in 2018 at Vladimir Putin's fourth inauguration. It has a nine-speed automated transmission with a 4.4-liter V8 engine with 598 horsepower and 889 newton meters of torque. It has a top speed of 249 kilometers per hour and can sprint from 0 to 100 kilometers per hour in six seconds. But the Aura Senat isn't the only car in Putin's collection. He's also been known to enjoy other high-end vehicles such as the Bentley Mossad and the Rolls-Royce Phantom. These cars are all renowned for their luxury and comfort but they're often used by world leaders and celebrities. Interestingly, Putin is also a fan of classic cars, and he's been known to collect and restore vintage vehicles. One of his most prized possessions is a 1956 Zill 115 limousine, which is one of only a few in the world. Putin has been seen driving this car on multiple occasions, and it's become something of a symbol of his love for classic cars. Interestingly, it's estimated that Putin's car collection is worth tens of millions of dollars, but for the Russian president, these cars aren't just a way to flaunt his wealth and power. They're a way to showcase Russian engineering and design and promote the country's growing luxury car industry. Yachts. Who else in the world owns a $125 million yacht collection? As you would imagine, Vladimir Putin's fleet of super yachts is outrageous. His fleet of stunning super yachts, both inside and out, is one of his most recognizable interests. One of his favorite yachts is named Olympia. It's 57 meters long and lives up to its name. The yacht was designed and built in 2002 by the prestigious Dutch brand Feedship. It has a 16-knot top speed and a 4,700-mile range. On the yacht, Putin is regularly seen chatting with international billionaires from around the world. 12 guests and 16 crew members can be accommodated on board, and with a whopping price tag of around $50 million, it's not cheap. Putin resides in the presidential cabin on the super yacht, which is situated on a different level to the rest of the accommodation. His suite is one-third the length of the yacht in size. You will also find a bar and a jacuzzi. The Olympia's interior features are maintained as a state secret, which only heightens its mystery. As exquisite as its name suggests, the second yacht Putin owns is the Graceful. It has a beam length of 72 meters and a volume of 2,685 tons and is sprayed in a bright shade of white. She was created by H2 Yacht Design and built by Blom and Voss in 2014. The six guest cabins on the super yacht can hold 12 passengers and seven staff members. The main suite is the largest room, while the next largest are the two VIP cabins and the three guest rooms. The 50 by 10 foot pool on the yacht can be converted into a dance floor with the push of a button, and the expansive deck of the boat provides a 360 degree view. The yacht costs an astounding $100 million, and as if that weren't enough, it needs between five and $10 million in upkeep each year. The Cheka, a seagull in Russian, comes last but certainly not least. The Cheka is very different from Putin's other luxury yachts. It is a tough explorer formally purchased in 2011 for the Russian presidential administration to host numerous ceremonial meetings with other political personalities. It's 54 meters long and was constructed in 2009 by Turquoise Yachts in Turkey. This one is significantly roomier than other ships of a similar size, thanks to the exterior design by Paolo Cagliari and the interior design by Jean-Guy Vergès. The main deck is home to a magnificent salon, measuring over 
over a thousand square feet, a roomy galley, and big windows that let in lots of natural light. The Russian president and his equally famous visitors can enjoy conversing in the formal dining space with glass doors and an amazing skylight. A six-person jacuzzi, a barbecue, a bar, and a spa pool with a magnificent glass waterfall wall are all available for more casual relaxing. Putin also enjoys the master stateroom with floor-to-ceiling windows, a study, a private bathroom, and a refrigerator. The other cabins, which can hold up to 12 people, also include high-end amenities, including entertainment systems. At a price estimate of around $35 million, it's designed for exhilarating voyages. Well, from his presidential armored vehicle to his magnificent yacht collection, Vladimir Putin has a variety of luxurious modes of transportation. But what about where he lives? Lavish houses. Surprisingly, Putin has 20 luxurious mansions, one of which is the $1.4 billion Black Sea Seaside Palace known as Putin's Country Cottage. It has a marble swimming pool, which is decorated with statues of Greek gods. A wine cellar, a theater, and a club-like place for pole dancing are also in this palace. A tour of the palace's first floor shows off a music room, a gym, and a dining room with $500,000 worth of pozzoli, Italian luxury furnishings, and a $54,000 bar table. There are also six bedrooms, each furnished with opulent Italian fittings, and well, a bar room leading to a lavish auditorium with two stories in height filled with more than $100,000 worth of wine and spirits. It has been reported Putin spends at least $2 million per year on a staff of 40 landscapers and gardeners. However, Putin has denied owning the palace himself. Private Jets One of Vladimir Putin's many pricey acquisitions is his unique $1 billion jet collection. It's tremendous. Putin doesn't think twice about cruising around in style when it comes to traveling. His rumored 58 aircraft and helicopter collection worth $1 billion tops it off. He has ensured that everything he possesses is lavish and out of this world, whether on land, in the air, or in the water. Surely, he prefers a unique, neoclassical style jet when traveling somewhere in the air? One of his favorite jets is the Ilyushin 296-300PU valued at $716 million. This fort-like aircraft can travel up to 900 kilometers per hour. It features all the amenities, including a gym, bar, and three beds, so that Putin can manage the army while moving. The plane also has a cutting-edge communications technology that enables it to serve as a command post for troops during combat. Then he added the Airbus ACJ319, one of his most expensive private jets. The jet was refurbished in 2018 and can accommodate 19 passengers. It features a master bedroom with a king-size bed, an ensuite VIP bathroom, and a shower. It also has a non-stop flying range of 10 hours and is equipped with streaming services and video conferencing features. It is not unexpected that Putin has an impressive collection of jets. He also owns 15 Mi-8 helicopters at $17 million each, 8 Tupolev Tu-154, $45 million each, 2 Tupolev Tu-204-300A, $47 million each, and a Dassault Falcon 7X costing $54 million. Wow, this guy really enjoys his air travel. Style. Russian President Vladimir Putin enjoys displaying his taste in fashion with pricey designer things, such as a $17,000 coat and a collection of high-end watches. For Putin, traveling in style isn't enough. He also needs to appear to be worth billions of dollars. He has a sweet spot for expensive watches. One watch always linked to him is the A. Lajanson 1815 watch. He regularly appears with the 36mm platinum version of this recognizable watch with the black alligator strap. The unusual model is simple yet conventional in appearance with an argente dial and hands made of blued steel. He also owns the Philippe Perpetual Calendar Moonface by Swiss watchmaker Patek Philippe, arguably the most valuable piece in his collection. The 18-karat rose gold watch is powered by the Caliber CHR29 535PSQ visible through the transparent case back. The magnificent timepiece is one of Patek Philippe's most elaborate wristwatches. It is punctuated with a moon phase indicator with without altering the watch for shorter months or leap years. The dial is elevated by an opaline white face and rose gold hands, and a brown alligator strap finishes off the watch's distinctive and fashionable appearance. Putin also owns the IWC Schaffhausen Mark 7 
18, which features a stainless steel case and a black dial with luminescence, and the Patek Philippe 5208P Grand Complication, one of the most intricate watches Patek has ever created. These two watches complete Putin's impressive collection of high-end timepieces. On clothing, Putin prefers high-end brands. He was even at one time nicknamed the Man in Black since he wore predominantly black suits. Indeed, every piece of clothing he wears is hand-tailored and custom-made. His preferred brand is Keaton and Brioni. Each suit costs at least 5,000 euros. On his footwear, he prefers Salvatore Ferragamo or John Locke. Considering each item costs several of thousands of dollars, his wardrobe is probably worth millions. However, despite the president's admiration of well-known brands, he cannot be linked directly with any label. As a result, the stylist who has been dressing him for many years scrapes off all the labels off his clothes before an event so that they avoid unintentionally drawing the attention of journalists. All high-ranking officials' wardrobe pieces often go through the same process. With all these assets Putin owns, he is clearly the wealthiest president in the world. But do you think the rumor is true that he is the wealthiest man in the world? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed the video, Video, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more of our luxurious content. And why not click on another video showing now? This is The Luxurious. Talk to you in the next video.